I'm Andrew Ward. I grow oilseed rape on a farm near Sleaford in Lincolnshire. We grow around 200 hectares of rape and it is fairly consistent uh, with the area. We get decent establishment because we're on a system similar to we are today where we're precision sowing it uh, in uh, 20 centimetre rows and we're using very low seed rates of between 20 and 40 seeds a square metre. So today we have learnt about sulphur requirements and uh, what we need to be putting on and looking at trials and it's interesting because where I am, I am not suffering too much from sulphur problems. We do apply it on all seed rape and what I've learnt today and heard today from the trials I'll definitely put into practice on the farm at home. And another thing that's been interesting today is the data and the research we've heard on Toprex which again looking forward into growing rape we need to get the plant short for helping with combining and helping reducing our cop costs when we're looking at harvesting and keeping the crop short. So learning about Toprex and hearing what rates to use and and the timings of that for me has been really really beneficial and also we stood in a crop today that has been precision sowed with a sugar beet uh, drill attached to a single unit that's been made from a farm subsoiler and I think that is a really really interesting innovative sort of design and looking at growing all seed rape precision sown in uh, rows and sowing it basically like sugar beet which is where we need to be in my view there's too many plants established on most crops of rape and they use this high seed rate because they're getting very poor percentage of actually plants established but sowing it in these sort of conditions the percentage of plants established is very high and I think that is the way forward for growing rape in this country.